In this tutorial we're going to run through Better WP Security's BAN options. We're already looking at the BAN screen. As you can see we've selected the BAN tab up the top of the Better WP Security administration area. And once again there's a before you begin message just saying that you can choose to BAN particular users based on IP address or user agent and so on. And the first thing we can do here in terms of actually securing the website is enable the default list and that list is maintained by hackrepair.com in particular Jim Walker so it's actually a really good list to use it's certainly a great start in getting your WordPress website security off the ground so I'm going to enable that and then click add host and agent blacklist so that's the first setting done the second setting we have is the ability to start banning in a more particular way so if you did want to do this, you can set enable band users and just check that box on. And then in the band host area, you need to put in IP addresses. So maybe you've got 214.41.22.3. Maybe that's the IP address that's really bombing your website. You can find these out from your access logs, usually in the administration area of your web hosts configuration panel. You can of course use wildcards as well, just using an asterisk in place of the final number. You can indeed use two wildcards, but you have to always use the furthermost right first. Then we can go and actually set bands for user agents. So maybe you don't want people with Mozilla browsers to get to your website, which is arguably a very unwise decision because most people doing that would be legitimate users. That's just an example of what a user agent is uh, for this example usually when there's a botnet attack taking place they would use a different user agent just to try and get around any bans or restrictions that might be in place that's really all there is to know about uh, the banning users ability in better WP security really the, the true value here is being able to enable the default band list and do so with just two clicks so if you have any questions about this or you know, really making the most out of it, aside from what we've already covered, please feel free to ask in the comments below.